Hello and welcome. Hi. I'm Trev. I'm Kez. And today, <laughs> the question that we all need answered, okay? Should we forgive Chris Brown? My answer to mm. that... I'm very curious. <laughs> Is it is up to the discretion oh, of the listener. Don't give me that. I have to do no, that. No, my. I, I have should you support abusers or not? Look. Yes or no? I don't. Chris know. Brown pushed Karinchi down steps. Oh, I didn't know. Yeah, you didn't. <laughs> he threatened to murder her. He told his friends, yeah, I'm gonna kill her so no one else can have her. Can Chris Brown dance? Yes! The man is gifted, okay? Can he sing? Yes. You're darn right he could sing! <laughs> and he also could paint, which I never knew. He could paint? He could paint incredibly! Oh, right. He can paint. Yeah, That's like the really man right. is like a Picasso. It's just like he has all this talent wrapped in one, and he's just a monster. After he punched Rihanna with all his might, it wasn't like he just stopped. It wasn't like he was just like, okay, I'm a better person now. No, he moved on to someone else and carried on all of that destruction elsewhere. Again, can he dance? Yes. Here's my take on it. A part of me is like that where it's like, boycott Chris Brown, everybody needs to boycott Chris Brown. We can't have this. And then another part of me is like- Oh my God, he could backflip. No, no, it's not even Whoa, that. It's what a song! Not, it's not, Isn't it, Paul? It's not even that. Breezy? <laughs> You're team Breezy, aren't you? I knew it. It's it's boiling down to, should all bad people be poor? <laughs> what? Does anyone really deserve to have their career stripped from them and be poor? Because of their behavior. Would I condemn Chris Brown to poverty? No. I don't want Chris Brown to be poor. I just want him to stop trying to kill women. You just want him to stop beating women. Right? Yes. Yes, I do. Do you think poverty will make him stop being beating women? Will change him? No. See, <laughs> if you if you want to solve the problem, okay, you have to you have to look. You have to look somewhere else. But at the same time, him being rich is not oh, going to sure, is not sure. gonna slow down his hitting speed. Sure. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> and that's, that's You should not be laughing <laughs> about this. We're going to hell for this. Now 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 look at this, right? Just hear me out. If you like Chris Brown, right? And he just punched Rihanna, and you have a concert ticket the next day after this news breaks. <laughs> okay? If you go to that concert. Let's say everyone goes to that concert. Let's say it sells out. If that concert sells out, we are sending a very clear message to his label. We're sending a clear message to anyone that works with him in that industry or anyone who will want to work with him that it's perfectly fine. And that's how we develop a culture. I just feel like support isn't the answer. Is poverty the answer? No, I wish we could give him a stipend. He did suffer a lot of backlash. I don't consider sold out concerts okay. backlash. But, uh, <laughs> I don't. When you know that someone is abusing other people and that person has a fan base, you know, like. Yeah, it cuts deep. You know, it it just, that messes with you. I kind of felt like a little icky just like, because because we watched the little Dicky video before we, we were filming. And I felt kind of like icky, like supporting him in that way even. And, and I felt weird because the video made him likable. Like, yeah, I liked the video. I, I really liked the video. I and it hurt the, my the soul music. that I liked it. Like he tried to, he pushed Karuchi down steps. You tell us in the comments down below, okay? Should entertainers who abuse people, should they be supported? Should they? In the comments, guys. And everybody, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.